Large AC manufacturers were optimistic about the increased demand for their products due to the expected hot summer. But unseasonal rains have played spoil sport and added to uncertainties. That, coupled with lower discretionary spending and intense pricing pressure, has led for tepid sales for these white good makers. The standout performer was clearly Blue Star in Q4, with over 20% revenue growth and more than 40% EBIT growth in the AC segment on a year on year basis. The next company which delivered strong performance on both revenue and profitability front was Voltas. Whirlpool and Hitachi have struggled, Lloyd and IFB have seen some market share gains but struggle to turn profitable. Voltas has been the market leader for a long time but it looks like the other players are now catching up, especially Blue Star. If you see the data from the last three years, on a compounded basis in the large appliance segment, Blue Star has seen a revenue growth of close to 30% and profitability of close to 35%. Lloyd also has grown at a significantly faster pace compared to peers, but the aggressive pricing has led to compression on their profitability. Voltas, on the other hand, has seen slower growth compared to the other two, with 20% compounded revenue growth and profitability growing at only 6%. If you look at the market share in the last five years, Voltas has gradually been losing market share. It has lost close to 180 basis points of its share and Blue Star, on the other hand, has gained 120 basis points. Voltas has been facing intense competitive pressure from both domestic and MNC players, as peers are now investing aggressively on capacity expansion and strengthening their distribution capabilities. Voltas is looking at hybrid model, adding their own capabilities over and above the EMS model. But this will take time to reflect in their performance. The capex for manufacturing also seems to be substantially lower when you compare it to the peers. It looks like we have a new leader in the making among the large AC manufacturers and people are taking note of it. In the last one year, Voltas stock was down 16% and Blue Star gained over 60%.